The ABCs of Death. Watch it now on iTunes before it's in theaters March 8th. It's the, the craziest anthology film ever made. I don't know if it's offensive, but it's it's unpleasant for sure. They basically asked us to sort of do the most crazy thing we could think of and try to outdo each other, which was sort of a nice challenge to have. And so I think a lot of us, you know, took that to town. What if our ABCs of Death short is the only segment in the entire film to feature an actual on-screen death, like, like somebody actually dies? Actually, that's a great idea. I got the letter W, and uh, it's W for what the f It's a, a short about your subconscious and what you're thinking about coming to life. My short's about sort of an underground fight club type of situation where the fighters, uh, where you're surprised when you see, you realize that the fighter's actually not fighting another man, but a dog. And then there's another twist in store. Well, I have the letter M, and M stands for miscarriage. I felt that most of the filmmakers involved in this movie were going to be like really outlandish and really like their styles were. They're all crazy people. So that's what I went for. I went for the kind of the the sort of cerebral gross out, if you will. Thank you, one promise. Your children will never know how this ended. The best thing about it is there's something for everybody. It's an ambitious and experimental horror movie. I think it'll have a long life because, uh, you know, you want to show people your favorites and, you know, everyone argues about what they like better. It's awesome. It's anarchy of a movie. It's, I don't, no, no one's ever going to make a movie like this again, so this is a one-time opportunity. The ABCs of Death. Watch it now on iTunes before it's in theaters March 8th.